Hey guys, and welcome back to the Dollar to Dotson Challenge here on Black Pearl Media. And we got another massive storage unit for only $170. So let's take a look at what we got. Okay, wow guys, this looks like a really huge unit. Look, it's even above my head filled with stuff. And it looks like there's a lot of household items in here, uh, a lot of plush toys. I saw some Disney plushes in here already, just at first glance, uh, some Hot Wheels stuff. There's obviously some beds and mattresses, which is probably why I got it for such a good deal. A lot of people don't like dealing with uh, mattresses and stuff. But honestly, I don't mind it because we have a dump close by. It's like $5 to dump one and it's it's worth it for me. Load it up in the truck and it's just a couple minutes away. So I think I'm going to have to rent this one for the month because I don't think I can empty this out in a couple of days. There's just way too much stuff. So I'm going to go ahead and end up doing that. Um, but I'll, uh, I'll probably do that in a, a couple days. We'll see what we can take out of here and uh, get get through. Now, if you're new to this challenge, you might be wondering why I'm getting all of this stuff and how I can possibly move it all. There's a couple ways that I do. One is whatnot, which you can find a link in my description below. If you use the code, you get a couple dollars to bid with, and I also get like 10 bucks for a commission. It's nothing that big of a deal, but it's cool to come hang out and you can buy some of this stuff at auction. I usually start everything at a dollar. The other thing is, Storage units, tag sales. Tag sales are really, really great for me. I had one, I moved a lot of items, I sell things cheap and I sell them in a way where they, they move, they're, they're gone. Uh, but while we're looking through all that bread and butter items, you know, a couple dollars here, a couple dollars there, we're hoping to find some items that are very expensive, some diamonds in the rough that we can flip to make a huge profit, to make all our money back on the unit. And honestly, there is a washer and dryer in here. I just saw. So there, if these things are falling, stay, 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 don't fall. This would make such a freaking loud noise too. So as I was saying, if these washer and dryers work, I mean, they're a couple hundred bucks. And if not, then they're easy scrap for like 20, $30. So either way, I'll get rid of them. So without further ado, let's get the GoPro on and let's go through some of these items. All right, so this is just gonna be our first little load here because I got a, a short bit of time today, but we'll be back probably in this video as well. We got a little plush toy here. So it looks like we got a lot of plushes coming in, but I'm gonna load up this bed frame because I feel like it's gonna fall and make a big noise and everybody's gonna be annoyed, including me. So may as well just get it out of the way now. I don't think we're gonna be keeping this bed frame because the the cushions that it comes with, cushions, the mattresses that comes with uh, seem to be ridiculously dirty and stained. So these are probably just gonna end up being scrap, which, hey, that's a couple dollars right here. This is not worth nothing. This is gonna be such a struggle. I, I can already tell this is gonna be a lot of this is gonna be a lot of cussing. Oh boy, I'm trying to keep it together. But I think once uh, all this stuff is out of the way here, we can kind of breathe a little bit more and kind of go at this unit a little bit more, I, I don't know, a little bit more organized, a little bit more with a plan. But you know what they say, it all goes according to plan until it doesn't. So it looks like we got metal and like this ABS wood or whatever it is. Oh, and I forgot the lights turn off all the time in this facility. Come on. There's someone here, turn on. Oh, if I gotta walk down all the way down here to get the lights to turn on every time, it's gonna be a pain in the butt. But at least I have my headlamp, so that's good. There we go. All right, I just have to move a little bit that way. Good thing I didn't go all the way to the end, right guys? All right, here we go. Some more, almost done with this loaded here. I actually have a lot of metal, so I'll probably uh, be doing a scrap run soon. Not just this here, but uh, some other items as well. Now I will tell you something about this unit that intrigues me is that there's a lot of bags, but they're up so high. So there's gotta be something that they're on top of, not just these, uh, these washer and dryer. I'm hoping for bins that are just loaded with treasure. Hopefully not a lot of furniture. Um, if there is furniture, that's okay, I'll take it. It'll be good for the uh, tag sale. People like to buy store, uh, you know, furniture from uh, tag sales and uh, that's not a bad thing. So 
Okay, what is this? Pro foam, I think this is like an exercising platform where you kind of step up, step down. Could be wrong. Got a bunch of stuff in here. Motorola box. We got some Easter eggs here. We got clothing, nice sweater. Some more clothing. There's gonna be a lot of clothing in this one. I, I can tell by the amount of bags everywhere. So hopefully we got some high dollar clothing or some stuff that's really worth something. Why do these feel so heavy? Do these have anything in them? Oh, they got candy in them. Let's go. No wonder they got, they were heavy. All right, come on, I'm right here. Now it's important when you go through a unit this big to just not get overwhelmed. Take it one item at a time and uh, kind of enjoy yourself, you know. You went through the process of finding one. It took a while, so look at that. It's a little dream catcher with a mirror. See, now this doesn't seem like a very expensive thing or a very cool item, but this is one of those bread and butter bread and butter items that will get sold for a couple dollars, and that's what keeps us going here. Teachings in the Bible. We got this nice like bassinet here. Then we got some clothes in here, stained clothes. ESPN Network. Maybe these guys worked at ESPN. Uh, which is pretty close by. It's a very popular place to be working. What is this? It's like a weighted slipper. Their spa warming booties. Let's go. One of these diffusers. So a lot of little tchotchkes in here that are worth a couple dollars. So that's nice. And then this bassinet is, uh, oh, it's like one of those rocking ones. So that's actually worth probably a couple dollars. So that's nice. All right, all that metal is gone. So now we can kind of get to some of these bags here. And I'm kind of interested to see what's in them. So I've got my table set up. I'm gonna try and keep these bags in like semi good condition so that I can, you know, restock them. But let's take a look at what's in here. Smaller bags, Reebok shoes, Uggs, more Uggs. Those are nice. What are these? Oh, Pumas, look at that. Sonic the Hedgehog. Those are kind of cool, okay. We have a matching set. Please tell me we do. We do. Look at that. Not a bad looking shoe, honestly. There we go. Got my headlamp on. All right. Some sandals. A little moccasin. Let's see here. Those are cool. What else we got here? You know, shoes aren't too bad. They are bulky to ship out, but you know, if we're going to do a tag sale, we can lay out a whole bunch of shoes and put just like a couple dollars on them. Maybe, you know, five dollars a pair or something like that that might go all right what are these um universal threads so i don't know what these are crown vintage we got a pair of fillas or fills had these before these are kind of stained up but we got some more shoes here tons of shoes these are kids sperry's sperry's are good we got some other kids here new with tags bippy so we got some bippy shoes maybe we'll find some nikes in here i don't know the original a bunch of shoes in here we're gonna have to kind of scoop through these here and if i see any like interesting pairs we'll stop and take a gander but this shoe has a piece of bread in it. All right, okay. I see Woody, there's some slippers here. We got some unicorns with zippers. We got a lot of kids' shoes here. Some Crocs, hopefully there's a, look at these. Those are really, <laughs> these are pretty wild. Look at those Adidas, hopefully I can find a match. Let's find a match of those if I can. Oh, all right, there's some Nikes. I need to find some matches to those. Those ones are actually like pretty cool. All right, there's a match to that. All right, we got a matching pair to the Adidas. So sweet, I'm gonna put that with these pair. These are like the cooler pairs. We can find a pair to that match, a match to the, oh, there's a Nike Air. I don't know what these are. Guys, sense me, sense me. Kids Nikes. Oh, all right, here's the matching set to this Nike. So that's cool. This is just like normal. All right, these are just like random shoes. Maybe we'll find matches later on but that's going to be a lot of looking so i'm just going to kind of take my time and if i do find any then sweet if not no problem what about this one here also we kind of looked at what's in here except for that so i'm going to take this put this on the cart oh, oh my gosh wow 
Oh gosh, come on. Holy cow, that was a mess. All right, let's see here. Bed sheets, Ooh. jacket, sheets. We got a bunch of jeans here, women's jeans. Some pants here. All right, Nova jeans, size five. Brand new with tags, so we got some clothes here to go through. Not the best time for jackets, seeing that it's about 85 degrees out. These are cool. I don't know what kind these are. Aldo, but they seem like they're in really good shape, so we like that. All right, we got some kids' shoes. We got some kids' mini Mouse shoes. Got some little Crocs. So we got this little sparkly Croc. I wish there was a set, but we're gonna put all of these in the shoe bag. And if we find sets, we'll add in the sets. All right, what's this? This looks like more clothes. We might go through the clothes later, just for sake of time. Because if we know it's clothes, then great. But you know, this looks just like kids' clothes and regular clothes. We'll have to do a deep dive in these later. Because you know, I'm always looking for vintage stuff. I don't know, a lot of this stuff doesn't strike me as vintage, vintage but you know, we do have to check. But I can check later and check back in with you guys and let you know if we find anything crazy. But you know, bag full of clothes. We'll just say that for now. Bag full of clothes. Man, this might all be, ooh, there's something potentially interesting in there. So let's go through these and let's get up there. So here's a match to that boot. I think that's a match. That might be a match. Minnie Mouse. What the heck is that? That's like a jacket or something. Old Navy. All right, nothing crazy. Might be a couple matches in there. Nike Airs, things like that. So we'll put this with our unmatched shoes. We can match those up later. All right, we got to pull out $170 worth of stuff in here, which I think is going to be easy. We have the match of this in this box. I know we do. I saw it. Okay. Little uh, Insta Mini X, which is good. Really good. Highland Original. Slippers. Looks like there's some interesting stuff in here. What do we got? What is this? I'm not sure what this is. Model luna not sure we'll have to look that up later some makeup stuff with a little makeup bag all right i'm liking stuff that's not just clothing because this is good tag sale stuff it's not like good whatnot stuff we got options here okay. Ooh, there's like something on there i don't know i felt i felt something oh it's probably whatever this is some lotion or something i should have my oh ooh, 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 ooh. Oh guys, this e this looks like it might be a little bit broken here or missing a piece, but even so, this could be a hundred dollar bill right here. It's got the battery. Let's see, can we turn it on? All right, it's out of batteries, but this Nikon, this will sell even if it's broken for probably 30 to $40. If it works, maybe over a hundred, 150. Oh, that is a good find. If we find a couple more finds like these, we're in business. So that's like conservatively like 50 bucks. We'll just say that. And if we sold it by the time this uh, video comes out, I'm sure editing Caleb will have put the amount on the screen. We've got a little fragrance here. It says VSL and it's full. So these can be cheap, like 30 bucks, or they could be expensive. They could be discontinued and expensive, like over a hundred bucks or a couple hundred bucks. I don't know for sure, but I will consult my wife and see what she says. This is a ring. I thought that might be a cap, but that's a good find. Some good finds in this bag here so far. Excited about that. All right, we got a cord that might go with the Nikon. I don't know. What's that? Oh, a little speaker. Okay. Oh my goodness gracious. All right, let's see this box here. This box is intriguing. It looks like it might have some video game stuff in it. So let's see. Whoa, heard something. I heard something. Oh, I heard something like a toy in here just go off i don't know if you guys heard that all right we got a lenovo cable we've got some baby powder some more baby stuff some disney baby stuff this is good some baby and kids shoes and clothes it's good some hardware a little key key ring oh it's got the little eyes popping out it's like me every single time i see something awesome come out Ooga, ooga. okay so we got some kids stuff some kids clothes you know, honestly, not bad. When I do shows, this kind of stuff is popular, especially if, uh, you know, it's Disney related or anything like that. People really seem to like it. So here's like a wall decoration, a K. Some more kids clothes. 
what's in here? There's there's like a whole bunch of clothing. Kids clothing and like hats and whatnot. Yeah. The lights turning off all the time is so annoying. I apologize. But tis life. That's what we gotta do. This actually looks really nice. I don't know what this is, but this looks nice. Oh, it's got a bear on it. What kind of is this? Heritage. Nothing crazy. You got a little sundress. I like that. It's got like a parrot on it. Look at that. It's got a nice parrot on there. It's nice. Oh, one of these. That's funny. I, I had one of these on my whatnot stream and I was just messing with it. And then I broke it right on camera by accident. And uh, I was a little embarrassed. All right. Nothing much in here. Oh, we got a Dis Florida Disney bottle. This will go for like 10 bucks. Maybe, maybe less, maybe more. Oh, and a Disney mug. People love the Disney mugs. And this one has a spoon holder. That's really cool. Larry Lee, Disney. All right, we like the Disney stuff. Keep the Disney stuff coming. That's what we like to see. We got ourselves a fire stick here. Amazon fire stick. Also might have the charger here. And what else do we got? We got a power cord. Oh, Funko Pop. We got Grogu. Everybody loves Grogu. Everybody loves Funko Pop. Oh, look at this. Sony Handycam. I have a funny story about, I just saw, okay. I just sold one for a hundred dollars on eBay. Um, but when they received it, it didn't have this power button right here. So they sent it back. So how funny is it that I just found another one with a power button? So this is another hundred bucks right here. That's great. That is fantastic. And look at this, another Disney bottle. Oh, this is gonna be great. I'm really excited about this. Caca, caca. After burn. All right, Call of Duty, it's in there. That's a win. Another Disney mug. That is a win, even though it's gross inside. We can get that cleaned up, no problem. We got ourselves Little Big Planet, but it's not there. All right, we'll keep an eye out for that. Look at this, an iPod, woo! iPods, they sell. I sell them on whatnot. I sell them on uh, eBay. I sell them all over the place. What is this? A Sony reader? That's pretty cool. I like that. And then we got ourselves a PlayStation controller. Oh, it's missing a button here. So, I mean, the, the sensor's still there, but not the actual button. So hopefully that's an easy swappable little part but otherwise this box has been killer i'm into it and look at this we got three belts wow all right cool so i'm gonna put all this good stuff back in here we're definitely gonna be taking this box with us today this is great the handy cam we got the other cameras fragrance bottle here whatever this is and we'll keep we'll keep loading wow that's awesome this has more clothes in it. Oh, it says like a hundred pounds worth of clothes in it. Looks like it's got a lot of Fashion Nova stuff in there. Got some new with tag stuff, so not bad stuff. It's just not stuff that I need to go through right now. We'll go through this at a different time, but let's see what else we can uncover here. I want to see what kind of, oh, wow. Guys, these are Samsungs with a nice top loader, glass top. If these, if these work, that's a couple hundred dollars at least. So that's a good find. That's a really good find. Wow. All right, pressing on a little bit more. We have more shoes, lots of shoes. David Stone. The light's gonna turn off any moment now, I know it. Ooh, Nikes, look how clean these Nikes are. Hopefully we got a set of those. All right, I'm looking through, I'm looking through. More Nikes, I'm looking through. Oh, that's a match to some ones I think I saw earlier. Some more Nikes. I'm like just putting like the Nikes aside. Oh, uh, I think that's like Paw Patrol or something. Some moccasins. So many shoes to go through. I might just have like a grab and go shoe section. How about those? These are also Nikes. I don't know. I'll have to go through these. These are Timberlands. These are kids Timberlands. So lots of shoes here. I'll have to go through these at home. All right, let's see what's in this box. This looks interesting. All right, so we got Joy. A little plush. I got another plush. Purple hand. Oh, very nice. Oh, Hot Wheels. That's pretty cool. I like it. So kitty cat plush. This one is Disney. It has the Disney tag. It's a Squishmallow. So those are always uh, a fun one. Little bunny rabbit and a tutu. 
All right, got a little dog. Now, I, I thought I was gonna kill it with plushes on, on whatnot, but they didn't really do that well. So I sold them actually locally on Marketplace for you know a good amount of money. I think I paid like, took like 50 bucks or something. We got Elsa, or uh, Elsa's sister, I forget her name. Um, so that's good. Oh, we got some cars here. All right, we got a Camaro. Pretty sure this is a Camaro. Yep. So that's, that's an interesting top. But we like the cars. Oh, the Eclipse from Fast and Furious. It's missing a tire. We got to find the tire. That's sick. I've never had one of these, and I, I've, I'm, I'm into cars. You guys know. You guys know that's what we're here for. We're here for the dream car. Man, that's gross looking. Look at that. Uh, maybe somebody will want to clean it up. So, Batmobile. Whoa, look at this. Transformers. That's pretty cool. Optimus Prime looking pretty sweet. He's got wheels on his feet. So that's a pretty cool find. Got some other cars here. Tonka. I don't know if these are like remote control cars. I'm not seeing remotes anywhere. Let me just put these aside for a moment. Got another one. Oh, sweet. I've always wanted to find one of these. <laughs> that's funny. Love it. All right, we got ourselves a little llama unicorn here by Peekaboo Toys. We got Jesse and we got Woody here. Pretty cool little action figures. Again, for Disney. We got Bumblebee here. Bet you he transforms. So this is another really good, uh, another really good box here. I don't know what all these characters are, but I'm pretty sure this is Mulan. I think. But well, we got some cool cars here. We got Thomas the train engine here. There's a power switch for something. Little uh, <laughs> little car. Uh, this is from Cars, number 95. And it's die cast, it's actually metal, so that's nice. And a little guitar. That's cool, all right. What's a cowboy without his hat? I just went over there. Ugh. Okay, all right. What's gonna be next so I don't kill myself? Probably this oh sounds like there's something heavy on the bottom so let's look into this so okay we got some blankets here hopefully you guys can still see everything all right more blankets oh disney little disney cash register that's pretty cool little llama a bra and uh, a neck cushion uh, what is this look at that a little backpack that's pretty sweet lots of kids stuff here but I think this is going to be good for whatnot and for our tag sale. Oh, that is cute. That little seal. All right. I think that's Paw Patrol. Yeah. More that tummy thing, but it's so dirty. So I don't know. Some of this stuff might be a little bit too dirty to let go. Maybe we'll donate some, but you know, we'll give people a chance to check it out. Little teddy bear by Cuddlewit. Oh, look at that. So we got more backpacks. Backpacks actually do pretty good on whatnot. So, you know, do they fetch like top dollar? No, but they usually sell. And selling is good enough. We got some more Elsa. Lots of Disney stuff in here, which I'm really liking. Oh, I heard something. Sesame Street. We got Elmo. Elmo looks like he's been well loved. A little narwhal bag. Love that. Some more woody, but this one is like fabric. Oh, nice. Little Minnie Mouse action. Oh, baby with a little koala outfit. All right, we got a Thomas the Train. Please put me on my wheels so I can play. All right, so you put him on the wheels, so that's good. Got some fish here. I don't know what this is. Put me on my wheels so we can play. All right, I'll put you on your wheels later. No worries, Thomas. We'll get you hooked up, we'll shut you off. We're gonna be playing solos the whole time here. And what's that? Glam glow? Interesting. Actually, it smells good. Whoa. All right, let me pull this over, take a quick look, and then I think I'm going to load my truck because we found some good stuff in this haul. And we haven't even, we, we, we have scratched the surface, but lots to go. So more plush, more plush, squishmallow, good stuff, plush, plush, Christmas plush. That's actually pretty cool. It's got weighted hooves, so it probably stands up. Oh my goodness, disgusting. Gross. All right, more used stuff. There's some stuff that'll probably, you know, go ahead and get donated, but some of the stuff is good. The Sisters, Pocahontas. All right, this is all plush. Some Disney stuff in here, but nothing crazy. I mean, I'm not seeing anything that's really like exciting me. Some Squishmallows, but like they're all, they're all dirty. They all need a wash. So, and there's like a little rolling suitcase here. Maybe this has some stuff in it. Let's look. Anything interesting in here? We got some books. Wizard of Oz. Uh, when Sophie gets angry, really, really angry. 
Oh, mirror. Ah, oh, there we go. Uh, the the Golo. I was reading the other thing. Okay. Um, uh, yeah, just some books. Nothing crazy in here. Boop. Stick fifty cents on all of these. Go from there. People go crazy. Fifty cents. Fifty cents buys nothing nowadays, which is true. I think that's a twin mattress up there. And if that's the case, that's pretty exciting. <sighs> Freak out. All right, let's just look through this one really quick. My curiosity is getting the better of me, so it looks like we have some baby hangers here. Those are actually good. Um, what do we got here? Hey, North Face, all right. Does it have something in it? Oh, just some like makeup stuff here. A front pouch. Anything in here. Got a dime. Oh, a glove, perfect. I actually needed that, this is perfect timing. There's some, you, know, you never know what you're gonna stick your hand into when you stick your hand in a purse. Oh, there's some money down here. Now we got a quarter, a couple more coins. Every coin helps, you guys, every coin helps. Oh, and there's some more, a couple pennies over here. All right, overall, that's a nice little satchel, little North Face satchel. That's not nothing, you guys, that is not nothing. All right, let's see if there's anything underneath these clothes that are worth anything looks like we got a little brush attachment for a drill i don't know it's kind of a random thing to be in here looks like we got a sand castle sand castle sweet that just means there's sand over everything oh, coach bag i don't know if this is real or not take a look in here i really seen anything going on in here so maybe that's real maybe not but they're bags people like bags got ourselves a Red, white, and blue football in here. Anything on this side? Just some toys here to go with the train. Little controller here. Fisher Price controller. Fisher Price is pretty cool. All right, seeing that I'm not gonna be bringing this to the truck, I'll do one more. Cause I need to get through all this and then I need to load the truck. And as you can see, there's lots of stuff. So I'd like to see if I can empty this out within the first couple days. I know I said earlier that, you know, I, I'll try and get an extension on it or pay for an extension. But I mean, if we could save a couple hundred bucks, it could be worth it, right? Some cars in here, some plastic cars. The light keeps turning off. Absolutely a bananas. We got some clothing in here. I mean, like, you know, clothing is good and everything, but I, I like the vintage stuff. I like, and you know, in order to, to, to go through all this, just, it's just so much work. And it's just, I don't know if it's worth the time and the effort. I mean, this is all really good kid clothes. And I can save it for the uh, the tag sale and just have people rummage through and just say, you know, uh, one, you know, a quarter for all of the clothing or whatever, whatever gets the more, more clothing out of here. And I could do that and people would have fun and pick through. This is a little, I think this is a little Disney thermos. Keep that. Some other stuff in here. But you got to look through the clothes because a lot of people add stuff with the clothes because the clothes act as like a protective barrier. So like, these are a pair of shoes. I don't know if they're good shoes or not, but I don't know, they have the box, so put those over there. What's this, nice little box here. Nothing in the box, but it's kind of like a flip. It's kind of cool. Oh, I remember this, Fisher Price has the rings. I wonder if the rings are in here. That's that smell. There are, there's a certain smell to uh, baby wipes. That's all messed up. This is uh, Disney, but that's, it doesn't have the lid. I'm not gonna keep it. Now look at this. That is an interesting bag. That's an interesting looking bag there. It's like a baby bag. We got some binkies. So we definitely had uh, some children around here. That's for sure. Had some kiddos. All right, all right. Bag here, nothing in here. A couple little toys down here. Oh, and with the lights off, we got ourselves a dollar bill, y'all. One dollar bill. Having the light turn off, uh, maybe that was a uh, good luck or something. I don't know. Nothing else down here. Got ourselves a car. That's a pretty cool car. A little Hot Wheels. Get big air. That's in re really great shape too. Wish there were some lids for these uh, thermos in here. Oh, this is one of those flippers. If you're happy or angry, those things are fun. Okay, what the heck is this? Lacrosse. It's kind of a cool jacket. Not many cool jackets or cool 
anything clothes wise in here so far yeah there's too much stuff in here i think i'm probably just gonna have to rent this out for the month i mean look at the bags and bags and bags of clothes and things i mean it's just that's overwhelming oh and it looks like we have a couch in here too i think i just seen a, a corner of the couch up there i don't know if you guys can see that but right there it looks like the corner of a couch and a chase so looks like we'll have a couch uh couch around here so that's not terrible it's not a bad thing if it's in good shape couches sell pretty quickly if you don't mind setting them up and i don't mind setting them up and we got this twin mattress here looks like this twin mattress might be in good shape or maybe it's a kid's mattress i don't know what you'd call that but man this is uh this is a lot of stuff this is a lot of stuff so all right i'm gonna call it here i gotta load up the truck with all of the stuff that we just went through some keepable stuff actually it's all keepable it's just am i going to keep it am i going to donate it am i going to try and sell some of it we have to go through some stuff uh and we have to think about how we're going to go through this because i imagine there is just clothes 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 but i'm excited because i think there's some more stuff than just clothes in here and i would love love for this light to stop turning off it's just unbelievable it's turned off like i don't know three dozen times since we've been here so yeah so like this is closed that's closed this is closed this is closed what is that what is that back there oh my gosh let me see that what is that what is this whoa i think that's a fireplace with a heater oh boy <laughs> boy oh boy we got a lot of work here we've got a lot of work cut out for us ladies and gentlemen <laughs> wow okay anything in here interesting there's some books in there there's a bible in there saw that already i think this is a baby carrier yeah i think that's a baby carrier are you strap it to your front holy cow look at this it's nice that's really nice this is all kids clothes wow okay as long as we have stuff to go through i'm good but man oh man there's a lot of stuff to get through all right so i'm gonna load up the truck and <laughs> continue on with this so i will keep you guys posted here's where we're at on the budget so far remember we also have the rv and that's gonna uh, get rented out soon so even though we have this amount of cash we also have like almost five grand tied up into the rv so we have that as part of the challenge and with that light going out I will clean this up and I will see you guys on the next video. Thank you so much for watching.